From afar, a windmill looks almost effortless, smoothly spinning on an endless loop. But the process of building even a single piece of these machines is truly a massive undertaking. German engineering giant Siemens knows full well what it takes. And they've made a 100 million euro investment in one of wind energy's most promising markets, Morocco. What you are seeing here uh, is a construction site for the first blade factory uh, in the Middle East and Africa region. Here they'll build blades like these, starting at 63 meters apiece for onshore wind turbines. The location alone was a major draw. In Tangier we are between the uh, Atlantic and the Mediterranean. Um, so we are actually planning to export a lot of our volume and we can reach a lot of countries here out of Tangier. Though the site is still a work in progress, Siemens is already training the native Moroccans that will eventually run the facility on their own. We're in full production, we'll, we'll need about 650 people. The talent pool is great. We've been able to, to fill the whole leadership team with Moroccan people that have great experience. At this temporary training facility, they try to simulate full-scale production. But one small problem does stick out. It's a great building. One issue we have is we're going to make a 63-meter blade in here, and the building's only 50 meters long. So we've had to adapt uh, some of the processes to be able to do that. So we've actually taken the blade and basically cut it into a couple of different sections. And it allows us to get the guys um, that are training here in Morocco uh, familiar with the products that they will be using, the handling of the products they're using, because they will go to Denmark, a lot of them, for really hands-on, intense training in the real-life production world. Morocco has goals to get 50% of its electricity from renewable energy by 2030. Siemens' head of wind power in Morocco says thinking like that makes the country a great partner for this kind of project. Wind energy is enormously important for the energy balance and for, and for economic growth in Morocco. The strategy to make Morocco less dependent on external energy resources and fossil energy resources make a lot of sense economically. So Morocco has the potential to become a major contributor to the wind energy industry. But they'll have to take it one blade at a time. Eleni Jokos, CNN. Come on, come on, come on.